A glimpse on the life of an embryologist. As embryologists, they help in making the dreams of infertile couples come true. As most couples or even ordinary people don't know what processes happen inside an IVF lab, here's a preview of an embryologist's usual day at work. First thing in the morning, check everything's cleanliness. Notably, cleanliness is an essential factor in every IVF lab. We need to make sure everything is sterile. Another usual task is the monitoring and maintenance of all lab equipment. Taking good care of embryos can be quite demanding, and we need to keep them happy in the IVF lab. We do this by ensuring that the conditions in the lab are just right for the embryos. We have to monitor the temperature, gas concentrations, as well as pH. The primary role is the monitoring of embryo development. This includes fertilization assessment of each patient's eggs on which ICSI was performed a day before, stripping, denudation of eggs on which IVF was preferred, transferring fertilized eggs to new dishes, including preparing, labeling with patient's name, and incubating a day before. Also, we do assessment of embryo development grading of day 2, day 3, day 5, day 6 embryos and add up the tedious process of documenting every procedure. We routinely give all our patients photos of their embryos after every cycle. We really take pride of our work and good quality embryos serve as testimony to the quality service we give to our patients and would-be parents. Want to know other procedures we perform? We do embryo transfer procedure. This procedure involves the transfer or placement of day 2 or day 3 embryos for cleavage transfer and day 5 embryos for blastocyst transfer to the patient's uterus. It's performed by guiding the catheter containing the embryo with a probe using transvaginal ultrasound to the transfer site, with or without anesthesia. It's expected of us to show every patient their embryos before transferring them to their uterus. And I talk to them about their cycle, quality of embryos developed, and giving them all the important details, from number of eggs retrieved to the husband's sperm information. We also do embryo cryopreservation procedure. This procedure involves freezing of supernumerary embryos after transferring the best embryos. And it should be noted that this procedure is done only after taking patient couples' consent. Of course, we're very keen on the preparation of sperm provided by the husband for use in fertilization of eggs retrieved from ovum pickup procedure. Lastly, during more relaxed moments inside the clinic, we try our best to update ourselves with the latest in our field as part of upholding continuous medical education. IVF is a field in which scientific advances happen very quickly. We read journals, medical researches, to ensure that we are up to date. It's truly fulfilling to be an embryologist as we are blessed to be the chosen few capable to make miracles happen in the form of healthy babies for couples that have otherwise lost hope at conceiving. Happy World Embryologists Day from ESCO Medical.